Alright, got lucky with how they spawn this time. This first level, you can get screwed with how they spawn sometimes. Alright, so we want weapons. Too bad. Now we get the UMP. And the glitch with this is a lot easier to pull off than I thought it might be. It's a little slow selecting that. So you'll see at the end of this night I'll equip the revolver and it'll like kind of glitch it so that you shoot it with rapid fire. Which with the revolver it's cool but where it gets really nice is when you get a shotgun. Little bit of a time save, not huge, but something. Now we gotta get lucky with survivors. Okay, that's really lucky. Now we need that the next night too. I'll just play this run out just to see where I'm at, but ideally we get three survivors on that night and then this night too. Holy shit, we've got a chance, maybe. Probably not, because I don't know what I'm doing. But I, don't, I don't think I have the finger speed to get world record. So I am curious, so there's, I think, one day before the hunting rifle where you can get the... Uh, the sawed off shotgun and I feel like that's a little better than the UMP but I'm almost wonder if I might as well just stick with the UMP so I can do the the rapid fire at the end with the shotgun with the normal shotgun all right so now we go after weapons and hopefully we get lucky and don't lose survivors okay wait, we're getting lucky So you can see there, night 9 or 10 is when you get the hunting rifle. And then once we get that, we just load back up on survival. Did I forget to do the glitch last night? I think I did. Uh, <laughs> that's okay. somebody that sucks all right really got to remember to do it tonight now that I have the shotgun so my personal best I don't know about the exact time it's over 19 minutes though I think like around 1920 I think I got on a run a couple days ago um, world record is 1837 and I, I think it's pretty optimized I might have to turn Kelpie off in a minute. I think it's slowing me down a bit. Hmm. 
Now we get the chainsaw, I think. Yep. Wonder what rapid fire chainsaw looks like. <laughs> So we didn't lose anybody that night too, so that's cool. I don't know if it's stupid to do that early or not. It's just it looked like there was a bunch of them all bunched up there, so I figured I might as well. Unfortunately, I have no idea if I'm on pace or not. All right, we'll stick with the UMP. Just, I feel like just getting that rapid fire is just worth it. And I think after this night, I should have the hunting rifle. All right, so we did lose a survivor. So hopefully I get lucky. I don't lose anyone tonight. So I only have to search one more night. That glitch is so freaking cool. Damn it, we lost somebody. Okay. So hopefully I get lucky one more time with survivors and find three after this night. Okay, we got lucky, so... Yeah, probably not going to be a world record. I just don't have that finger speed. Hopefully I can get under 19. It's been a lot harder than I thought it would be. So yeah, now we're maxed out on survivors and hunting rifle is all you need. So there's a 50 cal that that's by far the best weapon in this game, but that just takes way too long to unlock, unfortunately. 50 cal with the rapid fire glitch though, that would just be just fucking lit. And I don't think I'll have to repair the barricade. I get to like 20, I might, but it, we should be fine from here on out. And luckily in this game, your survivors, the zombies can't kill them. So they had that in the last stand too. The zombies like can charge and kind of kill one of your guys. Which is always fun. Never tried to speedrun that one. That one's... I don't even know what the strategy is. Is that one you like? It's the same style of play, but the difference is the knights, like, you actually have to pick the buildings you search, and then you, like, go from town to town as you try to make your way to Union City. And you have to decide. There's a couple of towns that you decide do I want to go to this town or that town? So I'm not sure what the best route is.
And then there's also obviously Last Stand Union City. That game is awesome. I don't know if the speed run of that would be necessarily super fun. I love to get this record. That's probably my favorite Flash game. Probably put more time into this one as a kid than like any other. Alright, our barricade's at a nice 69. Hopefully we can keep it that way. Six nights left, including this one. Yeah, record's not gonna happen, but God, I gotta hope I can get at least sub 16. Or sub 16, sub 19. Definitely have the strategy down. I mean, easy when somebody already, el someone else already did it, you just copy him. Because originally when I sped run this, sped run, speed ran this a while ago, I uh, went for the 50 KL. That's just, I don't think that's the way to go. So I know the last like two or three levels take, I think slightly over a minute each. So the reason I'm running this again is because I uh, saw they released like the Legacy Edition of all the Last Stand games on uh, Steam, and I thought that was cool. But I'm, I'm doing this on Flashpoint versus the Steam version because I was running it on Steam, and like I kept, I felt like I was getting screwed with like the survivors. Like it would say you found three survivors, and then I'd load up and I only had two, which is kind of annoying, and it wasn't happening as much. I'll just stick to running it on Flashpoint. Please die. God damn. Alright, well, as long as I stay focused, I should be able to get sub 19. I don't think the record's happening, but hopefully I can get close. I think you just gotta get super lucky with the survivors, which I did in this run, but it's, and then still you gotta pull off. Can't miss, I've missed too many shots. And then I forgot once or twice to use the rapid fire glitch. And I know I've promised it so many times, but I promise I will run Nightfire, it will happen. I don't know when, but I will. <laughs> oh, it's not gonna happen.
sus. Alright, two more nights to go. Got two minutes to work with. Man, come on. I almost wonder if the last night, if you have enough barricade, if you switch to an assault rifle and then so you can pull the rapid fire at the end. I almost wonder if that would work. Probably too risky. I'm not obviously not gonna do it this run. Just a thought. Please hit his legs. Yeah, the record's not happening. Or no, I don't know what I said. So record is 1837, I think. So I think second place is 1838. So that's why I think it's pretty optimized. Man, I gotta. Man, maybe 50 cal, if you could do the pull-off rapid fire with it. Because 50 cal is not like this where it's single shots. Each magazine holds like 10 rounds. Come on, sub-19 at least. Jesus, are you... That's lame. <laughs> Oh, it's my personal best, so I can't be too upset. But I can't believe it's that hard to get under 19. Man. <laughs> 